So What's going down y'all? Welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna to be doing another face shave on a woman. But the woman in the video is actually European. She's from Bosnia. If I have any Bosnian supporters, hey, drop a comment down below. I appreciate all of you guys. Uh, but I bring up the fact that she's European because not to be funny or disrespectful, but Europeans are just naturally more hairier, whether you're a man, woman, child, you know what I'm saying? But, but I bring up the fact that she's European because in the video, you guys will see a dramatic amount of hair coming off the face. And I think that just reflects back to the fact that she's European. Other than that, let me know if you guys are enjoying these face shaving videos. Leave a like, drop a comment. Let's get into the video. All right, y'all, first things first, we want to start out with the pre-shave treatment. It's very important that you follow these steps before the actual shave. So we're going to take some rubbing alcohol and wipe down our face. Now, what the rubbing alcohol is doing is removing any oil, sweat, dirt, makeup that's on the top layer of the face. And you want to remove this before the actual shave because you don't want the razor to have to fight through all this just to get to the hair. So it just leaves you with a cleaner shave uh, if you remove all this stuff right now. And next up, we're gonna be using this Nano Steamer slash Mister. Now what this does, it moisturizes the skin, it opens the pores, but most importantly, it softens up the hair before the shave. Now the steam that you guys see right here is actually hot water mixed with lemon juice. Now the lemon juice part is completely optional. You don't need that to, to complete this process, but I wanted to add lemon juice just to add to the aromatic effect of it. Like lemon, in my opinion, is the freshest scent that you can possibly smell. So I wanted to portray that to my client. So this is just hot steam mixed with a slight hint or a slight smell of lemon. And next up, we're going to be applying some Easy Blaze Shave Oil from EasyBlazeShavingProducts.com. Now that we wiped all the face of any oils, dirt, sweat, or makeup, you want to add a layer of lubrication, and I will show you guys why this is very important before the next couple steps. And next up, we're gonna be using a hot face massager. Yes, this is an actual massager. It's ultrasonic vibration. It is temperature controlled, so you can make it as hot as you want or as cold as you want. But for right now, we're gonna use the heat portion. Now what the heat does combined with the ultrasonic vibration, it just opens up the pores severely. It's increasing blood circulation. Uh, but my favorite part about this whole thing, it's relieving all the facial tension. It's relaxing the facial muscles itself. Uh, so it just it just makes for a super relaxing experience so i do this for about three to four minutes just to open up the pores increase blood circulation and most importantly relax the muscles <laughs> And the last step before the actual shave, we're gonna apply some Easy Blaze Shave Gel. Now what the shave gel does, it allows the razor to glide easier, but most importantly, it's gonna soften up the hair. So when you do hit it with the razor, it falls off like butter. And moving on to the actual shave, this is absolutely nuts. Watch with one pass of the razor how much hair comes off the face and how much different her skin looks after one pass with the straight razor. So as you guys can see, it is a dramatic amount of hair coming off the face. And what's crazy is this is hair that you guys can't see to the naked eye, but when you add lubrication such as shaving gel, it just clumps all that hair up into like noticeable strands. So it just looks so dramatic coming off the face, but it's really hair that you can't see to the naked eye.
And quick tip, when you're doing someone's mustache, what you want to do is you want to have them tuck their lip in. What that's going to do is going to create tension on the skin. It's going to create a tight pull on the skin. That way you don't nick the mustache area because in my opinion, when you're straight raising someone's face, the mustache area is most prone to, to be nicked. I don't know what it is. The skin is just super tender. So just have them tuck their lip in and it, it just creates a tight pull on the skin and you avoid nicking them. And for me personally, this is my favorite part of the video to watch. It's just so satisfying to see how much hair is coming off the face. But not only that, it's just how effortlessly the hair is falling off the face. It's just super satisfying to watch uh, for me personally. And now moving on to the post shave treatment, which is just as important as the shave itself. And what we're gonna do once again is apply some rubbing alcohol. What the rubbing alcohol does, once again, it, it removes all the oil, the shave oil, the shave gel, but it removes any bacteria that we might have left behind that we can't control as barbers. And next up, we're going to be using some Easy Blade Aftershave Spray. What this does, it prevents any razor bumps, any razor burns. It relieves any redness in the skin. So just spray it onto the face and massage it into the skin to add moisture and relief after a shave. And the last product that we're going to use to moisturize, protect, and repair the skin, we're going to use 100% organic face cream. Now with this product in particular, it is super thick, it's super rich, so it does take a little bit more time and massaging to work it into the skin, but I like that about it. I like the fact that I have to put work in, that's how I know it's getting into all the layers of the skin and the face will be deeply moisturized. <laughs>
And the last step of this whole process is to use the face massager from before. Like I told you guys, it is temperature controlled so we can make it as cold as we want or as hot as we want. So right now I have it cold enough. It kind of feels like an ice cube on our face, but not to the point where it's uncomfortable. So what the coldness of the massager is doing, it's locking in all that moisture, it's closing the pores, it's smoothing out all the wrinkles. But like I said before, it's relieving all the facial aches, it's soothing the skin, it's just relaxing the face before the client gets up out of your chair. Well, that's gonna do for this video. If you are new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. If you liked the video, hit the thumbs up button for me. If you want more face shaving videos like this one, let me know down in the comment section. But other than that, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.